the media have been camping out there for uh, at least a week now, uh, dozens and dozens of media, mostly Australian media, but also uh, Indonesian media. Uh, it's basically uh, been anticipated for a few months. Uh, there were talks last year that uh, her early release was imminent, uh, but then something seemed to postpone it. And then uh, this past Friday, the justice minister eventually announced that all uh, the paperwork concerning her parole uh, had been completed and the media were uh, expecting uh, her to be released um, as early as today, but uh, some of us did not expect it to, uh, to expect her to get out uh, very early this morning. Uh, but basically, this is a case uh, that's been getting a lot of attention here um, with uh, some or a lot of criticisms, actually, from members of parliament, from activists who say that she should not have got the early release, an early release for a foreign national uh, who had been convicted of drug trafficking is rare in Indonesia, but it's not unheard of. A few months ago, Indonesia also released a French national who had been uh, convicted of drug trafficking. Um, but the government and the uh, head of the prison today, after her release, uh, spoke to the media and uh, kept emphasizing and repeating that uh, she was not getting a special case. She had simply served uh, more than two-thirds of her sentence. She was, of course, sentenced to 20 years, and then she got a uh, five-year reduction of her sentence in 2012. She had served two-thirds of that and coupled with her good behavior in prison, and so she simply uh, has the right uh, to file for a parole, and uh, that right was granted. She will serve the rest of her sentence in uh, Indonesia. She will have to serve in Indonesia. And she has a sister who is married to an Indonesian national who lives in Bali. And so she will have to uh, live with her sister. Uh, she will be allowed to travel in Indonesia, but she will have to report uh, regularly to make sure that um, uh, she meets all the requirements of, you know, in terms of behavior and everything that she's allowed to do. Um, and uh, it's expected that she will stay in Indonesia until uh, 2017.